I got a knife and a little piece of watermelon. I will show you how to cut your watermelon. Come here, look, 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 look. You take your knife, say, and you go. <gasps> and I didn't even get all the way through. And then you take this and you add it to its little friends. Ah! And this, this goes to its friends too. Down into the garbage. Yes, sir. So, you got your watermelon? <sighs> Let's make some jam. <laughs> yeah. Reminds me of the babe. What babe? <laughs> that babe. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get serious to this stuff. You take this summer goodness and you drink it. No. What you do is you take six cups. Yeah. Mmm. A third of the way there. And we're gonna dump it into our batch. Not enough. We gotta go again. Gotta have six. <gasps> oh. Make it pulpy. Yeah. Hey, there's two more. Hey, here's two more. six cups. Now the question is, do we make a double batch? Do we really like jam? Yeah, let's do it. Let's make a double batch. Possession may be nine-tenths of the law, but I make the laws in this house, boy. And I pay the bills. Hey, look. There's two-thirds of a second batch. There's almost enough here to do more. Oh, and I did. Might have made just a hair much, but let's see. Oh, 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 oh! I think that's close enough. All right. There's a double batch of, uh, well, it was watermelon. Now it's pink soup. Yeah. No soup for you. So now I know what do we do there, Tay? We add sugar to it, right? Yeah. You want to guide us through the mess of amazement? What are you doing? Looking it up. Are you doing Pinterest again? Pinterest rocks. Nuh-uh. Pinterest. Add the sugar and the lemon juice. So we need 10 cups of white sugar. Ooh. I'll count. One cup of lemon juice. Okay. So let's go ahead and do a lemon. Mm. Some lemon. Lemon? From Winco? It was cheap, right? Two bucks? Mm, I didn't buy it. Three bucks? Who I don't bought? pay the bills. Who bought it? Who bought it? Who bought it? Who bought it? The bubonic plague bought it. Ooh, 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 how much? One cup. Oh, oh, just a little bit more. A little bit more. Just a hair. Little, ah, that's about perfect. Then we just dump it in here, right? I yep. guess. 
You sure? Yeah. Oh, you ruined my P sound. <laughs> Gosh. And then sugar. Right? So what are we what are we gonna do with all this jam when we're got it all boiled and ready to, to go? We boil it some more. And then what do we do? Then we can it. We're gonna can it. Like we did with the uh, spin spin. Spin spin me a letter. What letter did you spin? F. Anyways. It was kind of an inside joke for her and I, because we used to have this little toy that had a wheel, and the babies, when they uh, they were like, you know, six months, seven months old, used to spin it, and they used to sing the song, spin, spin me a ladder. And now we're playing, what guess letter? what drawer it's in. What letter are you going to spin, or something? That's a half a cup. You got some. There's another drawer right there. Ah, look at all this stuff. Is that a cup? Yeah, in the wrong drawer. Well, there's already a measuring cup in there. What size is that one? Not the one I want. Not the one you want. It said five cups for one batch, right? Five cups. I thought you said ten. Yep. Is it ten? It's five cups for one oh. batch. So Two. <laughs> That's the sound you were supposed to make last time you did this. Three cups sugar. <laughs> mm. Ooh, look at a bubble. Chemical reactions. No. Science is cool. Ooh, it is bubbling. Does that mean it's bad? No. It just means that the sugar is reacting with the lemon juice. Oh. All right, what number were you on? Three. Four cups sugar. More. <laughs> Yum. Five cups sugar. Ooh, that really bubbled. Six cups sugar. <laughs> That's from like the count, right? From Sesame Street. Yep. Seven cups sugar. Did you grow up watching Sesame Street? <laughs> yeah. Who was your favorite character in Sesame Street? My. Oscar the Grouch. Yeah. It was on seven, right? Oh. Oscar the Grouch. Eight cup sugar. Which version of Oscar did you like? Early the brown one or the green one? Green. Well, he was kind of a greenish brown, but he was more... What number are we on? I don't know. Should we run, we run the tape? I think this is ten. I think you... Shit. Ten... You shouldn't have been talking to me. Now we just screwed it up. Did you say nine? Oh, I think it's ten. That's it. Oh crap. What if you messed up? Bah. It's just not a sweet? Yeah. It's not the end of the world. So now. We gotta stir it. After we spank you. Ow! Ow! That freaking hurt, man. It's not a wooden spoon, lady. I think it's got a metal rod running through it. It's one of those polyneen spoons. It's like death to the butt. And you got pectin too, right? Not until it's boiling. Oh, we gotta boil it first. All right, we'll come back when it's boiled. Are we just gonna turn it on high heat? High heat. And we're gonna bring it to a boil. We'll be right back. <laughs> ah, no. It's still not boiling yet. See? <laughs> okay. It was only supposed to be a short little clip, you know, while we uh, boiled it, and then, okay, boom, you drop your phone in there, and I swear to God. It's your phone! Ha! I said, do you want to make- Sorry, folks, but that part needed to be edited out. Back to boiling. Or not. Oh, looks like Cleo wants to go outside and go potty. Run, Cleo, run! In the dark. Ooh, her eyes glow, it's so weird. It's still not boiling yet. Are you sure you got thing turned on? It says hi. Ooh, something's burning. That's smoke, man. You should clean the stove. Hmm. No? Okay. Hun! It's 
not boiling yet. Not yet. So, did you have a male PE teacher or a female PE teacher? When? In high school. I didn't take PE in high school. Why? Because I took performing arts. Oh, you're one of those. I'm one of those. Oh, God. Is I'm that... one of those. Nope, it's not boiling yet. God, this is taking forever. <gasps> is that a bubble? I think it's boiling. Is that a bubble? It's boiling. It's a bubble. Look. Stir it, bitch. Hey, you're recording and you just called me a bitch? You're going to hell, baby. And if hell was a place, it'd be a fancy dining restaurant. And they would serve... Ah, oh, jelly. It's actually kind of a jam, actually, isn't it? it's it's more like watermelon soup. Right now, it'll thicken up when. Which is better than button soup? When we Do add... you remember that story? Oh yeah, the something button. What was his name? Benjamin Button. No, oh. Scrooge. Oh, I don't remember that story. Tell me about Scrooge. He Daisy came to see him, and he didn't have anything to eat, so. She told him she'd make him button soup. So she threw a button in a pot of boiling water. Yeah. And told him that the soup would be much better if he had some onions. Ah. Uh. So he went down in the cellar and got her some onions. Uh -huh. And she goes, you know, the soup would be even better with some carrots. Carrots? So mm -hmm. he went down yeah. in the cellar and he brought her some carrots. I'd go get carrots for a butter soup. So she goes, you know, it would be even more cellar, more awesome with some potatoes. So he went in his root cellar and got her some potatoes. She goes, you know, this is really good, but... It's missing something. What'll be really great is some meat. So he went out to the smoke shed and brought her some meat. Mm. And by the time the button soup was done, Still they not. had enough to feed the entire town. Yeah, well, this isn't done. <sighs> this watermelon just takes forever to boil. It sure is a pretty. Why are we? Out. Why are we using this big because pot? Because it's supposed to like really bubble up. And a lot you... of people said that even their biggest stock pots have bu bubbled over. Oh, so we'll make sure it doesn't boil over. Um, I know I have to clean, but I really don't want to clean more. Oh wait, you clean. That's right. Yeah, my Cinderella. Why do we always have to? Why is our kitchen always dirty? Cinderella, oh, Cinderella. It's because we're Martin always Day, cooking. It's because we don't have magic mice. We had a magic mouse, but he died. Night and day, Cinderella. Do the dishes, wash the laundry. All right. I don't know what the hell you're trying to film, but you're getting everything but me. Blah, 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 blah. Hey! Privacy. I know this is high definition, but that's not necessary. All right, we're gonna let it keep boiling. <laughs> it hasn't even started yet, really. It's boy, getting warm. Boy, oh boy, I'll totally in trouble. Hmm. Care to eat some pi some uh, pineapple? Yeah, right. Care to eat some uh, watermelon? No. It don't look good to you. Oh God! Why did we let this crock pot get so nasty? Cinderella, Cinderella, night and day, Cinderella. Time for a new brush. This crock pot is nasty. Is it still boiling? No, it's not boiling. Hey, yeah, wait my face. It's not boiling yet. Is it gonna boil? God. Clean it, boy. You know, I think my mom said something to me about a boiling pot, but I don't remember what she said exactly. She said, don't touch it, you idiot, it's hot. No, something else. Um, don't lick it? Yeah, I tried that once, ow. Um, no, there was something else. Something about a boiling pot. Oh, a watch pot never... Oh, shizzle! We can't watch it. Otherwise, it won't boil. Alright, come on. Forget the dishes. Let's go. What do you mean, forget the dishes? I mean, forget the dishes! That thing ain't gonna boil if you don't freaking watch... Mm. No, stop watching it. Let's go. What do you mean, forget the dishes? All right, you guys, so this looks like, um, right now it looks like something from our last trip to Yellowstone National Park. Yeah, wait, 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 no, there was no lava at Yellowstone. Looks like something from Hawaii. It looks like the paint pots. Oh, okay. Um. I'm just over here just doing dishes, don't mind me. 
So we're just um, <clears throat> boiling it and it's got to get up to 220 degrees. Right now we're at 140. Mm -hmm. So just a little while longer boiling and then... How do you know what temperature it was? Did you use this thing? Yep. That's a meat thermometer, you know. I know. That's okay. You don't need a candy thermometer? I need a candy thermometer. I don't have a candy thermometer. So, yeah. Okay. Well, I'm just, um, are you gonna chilling and... like a villain and... You're going to come do dishes, right? <laughs> Seems like I, I'm always over here at the sink. Yeah. Love you. Yeah, right. I think it's boiling. It looks like it's boiling. What do you think? Yeah, it's boiling. And uh, look at all the dishes I did. There's a little bit more. Still got those to do. Those are done. They just need to be rinsed. So this is the jars I got. I don't know if uh, these are pint jars. They're ball. And then I got a couple of these little ones to give to my boss. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Count with me now. We need... Three, six, nine, twelve. Okay, we need twelve things of pectin. Here we go. One. Ha ha ha. Two. Ha ha ha. Three. Ha ha ha. Four. Ha ha ha. Five. Ha 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 ha. Six. Uh huh. Is there enough? Eight. Nine. Ten. Come on. Oh, what was that crap? That was, we're estimating. No, you can't. Oh. There's no way to get this big. Although smoke. this has been boiling for a while. You can see where the line was. We've concentrated this at least by half. Do you think we should add? Try, we're, it's just by trying to get more water or more no, heat I, in it. Do you think we should... More volume out of it, you mean? Yeah. No. <laughs> okay, no, seriously, I'm all done. Um, so, we are now done boiling. We put the pectin in. We let it boil for another five minutes. Got it all nice and thick and jelly-like. Now we're just scooping it in to our individual jars like crazy people. Because, well, we're freaking crazy people. Whether my husband wants to believe me or not. And we're sticking with, like we did with the other one too, right? We're doing that same headspace. Yep. Right where it's at that notch. Okay. Yep, that's the plan. These two are a little bit high, but... I always do high on the smaller ones for some reason. You still have more watermelon. Yeah, but I'm out of pectin. I gotta go get some more pectin because in my freezer, follow me and I'll show ya. Whoosh. All right, in, in your my freezer. freezer. Yeah. My mama got me some fresh picked mixed berries. Okay, so dark. Whoa, that's a lot of berries. That and are not frozen. And there's two of them, right? Yes, there are two. So what kind of berries are in these? Um, these are. Blueberries, raspberries, blackberries, and some strawberries. And they just hand-picked them all at yep. her friend's garden? Well, I think they went to um, up north. Green Bluff? No, to, um, I think there might be some huckleberries in there, too. To Priest Lake. Oh, okay. Um, for a berry picking season. They do a big thing up there Okay. every year. And what are we going to do with those? We are going to do exactly what we did here. We are going to mulch them and then add our sugar and our lemon and boil them and then add our pectin. Why Why do you add the lemon? What does the lemon do? The lemon adds acidity. Okay. Um, is that so for that canning? So that we can can it correctly. Okay. And the pectin just is a thickener then? Yes. The pectin is a thickener. It's also a preservative. Okay. I just kicked the garbage can. It hurt. I bet. So one down. Yeah, that's hot. Um, you should be very careful. Um, do you think you have enough in here for all six of these jars? Or do you think we're? Yeah, we might. <clears throat> and these are just the the pint, right? 
No, yeah, these are the pint jars. Yeah. The big ones are the quarts. Yep. And they're wide mouth. Um, and I don't remember what size those were. They were the little, little ones. They're just little jelly taster jam ones. Mm hmm. Good for giving out for gifts and stuff. And why are we giving uh, my box um, a, one, at least one of them? Because she gave us the jars. Like, what was it? Five flats of jars? Yeah, I think there's uh, there's five or six boxes worth of jars. They're all completely full. Uh, we've got both the pint and the quartz and uh, lots yeah. of them and gave them to us for free with the rings and, and even a bunch of seals. It's kind of cool. So a big shout out and thank you to Cheryl, which she doesn't have um, a computer because she's not into that for some reason. But uh, thank you so much. I appreciate all of the help with giving us something to put it all in. That one's getting close. All right, we'll be back in You're just flashing a the camera before I even get it turned on. What the hell's with that crap? It's flashing the cameraman. It's different. Style. Oh, well, I wasn't even looking. Crap. You had to because you know it's so, flashing. What's going on? We's done. Nuh uh. We's done. Well, you didn't Celebrate. do. You didn't really finish the canning process. Yes. Um. If you want to see a canning process. Watch any of the 25 previous videos that my husband has done on the canning process. There's 25. Did I do it that many? I didn't do it that many times. It's about 25. All okay, right, so what do we got? We's done. We have six. I thought there were seven. There's six. Six big jars, seven little what jars. What size are those big jars again? Those are pints, right? Pints. What size are these little and things? And it's a little bit, because it's still warm, it's a little bit runny. Um, Could you're you moving it all over, I can't even look at it. <laughs> yes, because it's still warm. It's, it's a little bit runny. Yes, but it, it will definitely thick it up. Yeah. And now, my my lovely uncle and I got the taste test before, and it's yummy. What exactly does it taste like? It tastes like... Oh, hell with you. Oh. It's bright light. What exactly does it taste like? It tastes like watermelon with a little bit of pumpkin flavor to it, I think. Lemon! Peace, baby. Lemon. And you think a little bit of pumpkin flavor? A pumpkin spice to it, I think. Well, there's no spice to it, but... Well... You think it's because maybe it's concentrated? It could be. It's delicious. I can't wait to try it on some toast. Oh. These two did a fabulous job. Okay, enough with the compliments. <laughs> All right, friends, that's pretty much it. You know, we're done here. Um, I'm being followed. Crap. <laughs> uh, if you like our videos, definitely give us a thumbs up. Comment, subscribe, uh, share, of course. And uh, if you have any suggestions, you know, for... Spread the goofiness. What we could do here in the kitchen to have a little bit of fun ne next time. Oh, wait, she's my wife. That's okay. Do it again. <laughs> uh, definitely, uh, definitely let us know. And uh, we will try to oblige. You know, I, I was thinking, you know, it'd be really kind of cool. I got all those peppers out there. How about like a jalapeno? How about if we do something in the kitchen that doesn't revolve canning, like actual cooking? How about tomorrow? I know. I'm going to show you. That's right. How to make a bowl of cereal. <laughs> You're a dork. <laughs> all right. Bye. We'll see you next time we're in the kitchen. No. <laughs> Look at that. Isn't that pretty color, though? Ooh. All right. We'll see you later.